Welcome Aquarius, welcome to my channel. Whether you are returning or whether you are new, I welcome you and I thank you for being here. I thank you for watching another reading. And I also thank you Aquarius for being the most watched reading of my last Zodiac series. And so you get to be the very first in this series. So let's get started. What I wanna to do today is take a look at what your soul is wanting you to know today Aquarius. <clears throat> you take whatever resonates for you and leave anything that doesn't and feel free to watch any of your other placements as I post these readings for the rest of the Zodiac, okay? So thank you again for being here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you guys so much. Let's get started. What does your soul want you to know today? What are we focusing on today for Aquarius? What is their soul need to tell them today. Thank you, thank you. For my Aquarius or cross watchers, you are welcome too. You take whatever resonates for you. Energy is always changing, energy is interchangeable, it's always fluid, it's always flowing. <clears throat> so you take it how it resonates for you because you know your situation. Aquarius soul, what do they need to know? abundance i love it it says i am a limitless being and i can manifest whatever i desire in this physical reality abundance seems to be the theme for today aquarius at the time that i am recording this reading my instagram uh, my card of the day for instagram is the empress card and that as we know is the card of abundance this this is um Lots of red, Aquarius. So this is your root chakra. You might be actually focusing on your abundance, focusing on your stability at this time, getting really grounded in abundance, building your success, building your money, however that fits for you, Aquarius. Ooh, envy. <clears throat> so this can go two ways, Aquarius. This can be you maybe comparing yourself to others and your soul wants you to know that you have abundance all around you. You are manifesting abundance. Don't compare yourself to anybody else. Really just work on your self-worth and your, know that you are valuable, you are worthy, and you are more than enough. But this can also talk about somebody envying you, Aquarius. <clears throat> oh, and it says, I am the same as everybody, but with different challenges. All right. And on the bottom of the deck, <laughs> we have self-esteem. I love how they always tie it with whatever I'm saying. I just love my cards so much. You cannot make this stuff up. Self-esteem. I possess gifts of the soul that benefit me and others. So this sounds to me like there's some, some comparing going on, Aquarius. You may be comparing yourself to somebody else that you perceive to be more successful or more abundant than you but your soul is wanting you to know how beautiful and valuable you are work on your self-esteem this week work on your your value your worth and know that you are a you have abundance here <clears throat> you have abundance and even if you cannot see it in your experience right now Aquarius, it might just be that all the pieces are coming into alignment right now. You might be going through a learning curve or a healing process. It's a journey and you just need to trust. You need to trust in the abundance that is all around you, the abundance that is yours by divine right. Maybe you need to put some more belief in knowing that you are supposed to be abundant in all areas of your life because abundance is yours by divine right. So let's see what the cards have to say about this abundance and envy situation. Nine of Earth. Wow. If this is not the epitome of abundance right here, this is the minor arcana um, empress. Just as I was saying in the beginning of this reading, I posted my card of the day. It came to me in a dream actually last night. And it was the major arcana empress. And here is the minor arcana empress. So you are being taken right into this energy. If you're not feeling it right now, this is the energy of independence, self-sufficiency, 
really enjoying the fruits of your labor. She's very abundant, this energy. Whether you are a male or female, doesn't matter. The energy on this card is abundance. It's abundance in all areas of your life. And it's somebody who is very grounded and stable in their self-worth, in their self-esteem, and knowing their value, knowing their worth. So your soul is calling out to you, telling you that your abundance is coming. If you don't see it in your in your reality right now, your abundance is coming. And it's big, actually, because this card talks about a lot of abundance. So much coming in in the form of money that you can actually buy yourself something nice. Maybe some of you want to buy a house or a car and you can take this as confirmation that you are doing exactly that very soon if you're not already. This is somebody who's enjoying the fruits of their labor, who's taking vacations, who's having contentment and peace in their life, maybe for the first time in a long time. Maybe you've been struggling in your finances and you just need that confirmation to know, whoops, that abundance is coming for you. Let's get some more cards. This is already a beautiful reading. Wow, I love this for you. Aquarius, what does your soul want you to know, Aquarius, or cross watcher? Aquarius, what does their soul want them to know? Justice. Wow, I love it. Justice. Look at this beautiful justice card. So if you have been waiting on some kind of legal situation, it's going to go in your favor with justice here. Justice is, is served. The truth is served. Justice is all about balance. Maybe there's been some kind of an imbalance in your life, in your energy, and you've been recently had, had to go through some kind of a journey of, you know, challenges. And it was all for the, for, to bring abundance into your life. Maybe you had to go through some kind of, I don't know, challenging journey, challenging season to bring this abundance, bring this independence, bring this self-sufficiency. But you know what? You don't have to compare yourself to anyone else. You just have to put the intention out there and tell the universe you want that abundance that you see that somebody else has that you've maybe been a little, you know, comparing or envious about. And know that justice is coming to bring it to you. Justice is a destiny card. Justice is coming. This is all about balance. This is all about righting the wrongs of your past. This is all about getting back double for your trouble, Aquarius. And I see a full moon here. And we're, we have a full moon coming up here very soon. May or may not happen for you then. You'll have to comment down below and let me know. Within the next full moon, you may be receiving some justice. You may be receiving a settlement. You may be receiving your abundance or the beginning of your abundance. Wow. And I know that today, today is the 25th of February and you may be watching it at a later date. So this could pertain to the next full moon from whenever you're watching it. But I see that moon there. Oh, wow. Let's see what we have. Oh, the chariot. Another destiny card. You're going through something that's very important. Okay, Aquarius, you're going through something very, very important. And it's all about your, your abundance. Isn't that something? I find this very fascinating. And justice is coming to, it's coming in your favor. Justice is coming to bring val uh, balance to you. And it's going to happen fast. If you're not in this energy or experiencing this energy, this may be a confirmation for you. Um, if you're already experiencing this justice and this abundance, if you're not, get ready because it's going to happen very quickly. You have the chariot here, which is very fast forward movement, very positive, very you, you getting promoted to, you know, a lot more money, you getting recognition and you having success and abundance. This is so beautiful. I love this card. And uh, as a side note, I always see the dark and the light ponies in this card. And I, it always speaks to me about soulmates. So if you're looking for love, you have justice coming. You have this chariot showing this soulmate activity here. You have abundance and love. You have abundance after you've really built, built your self-worth because that is what this is all about. This nine of pentacles here. It says nine of earth in this good tarot deck. But this is somebody who 
is focused on building their self-worth. They've gone through a period of maybe going through, whoa, maybe going through some healing to build up your self-worth again and work on your self-esteem. Know that you're worthy of that love that you, de you desire. And then justice comes to bring balance. Justice comes in your favor and you have this soulmate chariot here that is going to bring you that soulmate person that you have been working on yourself to be ready for. Looks to me like you're ready, Aquarius. Looks to me like you're ready. So get ready because this may come at, at you know, completely out of nowhere. It may come as a shock to you when it happens. <laughs> Let's see what's on the bottom of the deck. Ooh, the queen of water. So it may be a fi uh, fire. Well, I guess it could be a fire sign, but because I just said that, but this queen of water, she's a water sign. So I don't know if that resonates for you at all. Somebody who's loving, who's ready to give their cup, who's ready to pour into you, who's ready to be dedicated and trustworthy and loyal. Somebody who has a lot of love to give you, Aquarius. You are going to feel so loved. So get ready. May or may not be a water sign. That part doesn't really matter. Let's see if there's any advice for you from your angels. Any advice for Aquarius regarding this whole reading and their abundance. Any advice for my Aquarius watching? Anything else? balance here's your justice justice coming again they were serious you know when things come out twice it's like they're saying we meant what we said you have balance you have compromise you have justice so expect justice you know expect it oh my gosh Aquarius, this is an amazing reading. I'm so stoked for you. I'm so excited. You have abundance here. And look at this person on this card. She's in alignment. You are ready. You are in alignment because you have been working on your self-worth. You've been working on your self-esteem. You have been getting yourself ready, clearing out all the old, the toxic stuff, the old hurts, and doing all the work. You're ready. However this resonates for you, Aquarius, you take it how it resonates. If this is love, if this is money, if this is both, you are getting it. You are in alignment and you are ready. Let's see what's on the bottom of the deck. Wow. You have an opportunity of a lifetime right now that is coming your way to bring you this abundance, bring you that stability that you've been looking for and working so hard for. Things are going to take off very, very quick. This reading just all these cards tie in together you have success you have abundance and you have really everything coming in to place for you you have justice you have an, a golden opportunity you have the chariot this is a very important time for you right now aquarius and i am so excited please please comment below and let me know when these things unfold for you let me know if this was confirmation for you and um, remember, whenever you're seeing this, it's for you. So you take what resonates for you and you leave what doesn't. And you make sure you tell me what resonates because I'm excited to hear about it. All right, Aquarius, I will see you in the next reading. Thank you so much for watching. And if you resonated with this, I would love for you to subscribe. And I appreciate it. Thank you so much. I love you guys.